Gay marriage and birth breakdown, friends. What do y'all think? What's right? Gay marriage and birth breakdown. When's it gonna happen? Hey friends, it's me, Bill and Jack, looking down at you fine folks as you scurry off to work on this fine Monday morning. Wearing your fancy britches, doing the good thing in the CBD of the greatest city in the world, Brisbane Town. And here's the thing, it has come to my attention, sitting in the cafes of this fine city, our fine city, listening to the chit-chat of you fine folks, that a lot of you all worried about the gay marriage. I don't think you should be, because there's another issue. And it's about fundamental ideas of fairness, or as we call them here in Australia, a fair go. Giving someone a fair go. By the way, friends, that ain't just a saying here in Australia. That is also a saying in many parts of the United States. Giving someone a fair go. Now, back in the day when Brisbane Town was a lot rougher than it is now, you needed a dick and three balls to survive in this town, friends. When I first came here, that's how it was. Today, well, it seems that every other dude walking around is gay. And I hear on the news, because I joined the internet, I have a friend who has a son who is computers minded. And he helped me buy this brand new computer. I got a good bargain, only $5,000. And I got the modem with it too, so I can connect to internet. And this is my first month on internet. It has opened a whole new world for me. And what else opened a whole new world for me was when I saw the news. That gay folks are getting married in some places. And a lot of people here in Brisbane Town want it to happen here. And so this is my question for you fine folks out there. If it's okay, wait for it, if it's okay for them gay folks to get married, why ain't it all okay for y'all to marry your own opposite sex, sister or brother, or whatever you have. Okay? If it's okay for people to marry someone who is the same, like a, a dude marrying a dude, why ain't it okay for someone, if that's okay, then why ain't it okay for you all to marry your own opposite sex, like if you're a dude, marrying your sister, or if you're a lady, you marry your brother. Why isn't that okay? I don't see that in the news. So, I came up with another idea, and I think you'll like it. Tell me what you think below, by the way. But here it is. Wait for it. This is real genius, friends. If it's okay for two... I saw on the news a wedding ceremony with these two dudes marrying another two dudes. So, if it's okay for two dudes to marry another two dudes at one of them fancy big old group weddings, they had the cake and they had the flowers, they were all dressed up in matching suits, and they had the flower girls and the flower boys, and everyone was all dressed up looking nice and spick and span... If that's okay to two dudes to marry another two dudes in them big fancy group weddings, then why ain't it okay for two brothers to marry two of their own sisters in one ceremony? I don't get it. I, I, I just don't get it, friends. And if it's okay for two dudes to marry two other dudes, then why can't you marry your aunt's mother, brother, sister, whatever, 
whatever revs up your engines. Makes you go big old thunderclap inside, down in your belly, and your lady parts, or whatever, whatever you got. What do you think, friends? I think it's interesting. Well, please rate, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Don't be able to jack the truth below. Gay marriage and marrying your own sisters and brothers, friends. After all, ain't we all just sisters and brothers of the same people on this planet in this small world in which we live? Okay, friends, don't be able to jack the truth below. Bye for now.